evening, guys. Thank you for your patience. Thank you for waiting. How was day? Hi. <laughs> okay. Hi, good evening, teacher. everyone. It's good to see you. Um, thank you for turning on your camera because in that way I can see you. <laughs> I'm not talking just to the screens. <laughs> okay. Well, guys, today we have our class number seven. And um, let's see. <clears throat> Today's topic, we are going to review prepositions of place, numbers, and also negative statements. Okay. Today's Friday, June 30th, 2023. Oh, we have a lot of objectives. One is that you will learn how to use prepositions. You will listen to a conversation that illustrates yes, no questions. And you will become familiar with numbers uh, from 11 to 100 and more. So do you remember the prepositions? What are the prepositions of place? In in front of, behind. Yes, in, in front of, behind, on. On, next to. And under. Under, and do you remember uh, the other one that we see, one that is in the middle, when something is in the middle of two things? Between. Excellent, Karina, yes, that's between. And do you remember that I assigned you this homework on, I think it was on Tuesday, but I forgot to check it. I, on, yeah, on Tuesday, I forgot to check it yesterday. <laughs> so um, yeah, if one person, everyone had a number. Well, not everyone, but some of you had a number. Who had number one? I don't remember the number one, two, three, four, but you should remember your number. Les había asignado una oración? Les asigné algunos. Who had number one? ¿Quién tenía el uno? Ah, okay, maybe that person is not connected. <laughs> okay, so volunteers for number one, or you can tell me what is the number one. There is... There is a ball on the arm shape. That's correct. Thank you, Karina. Okay, number two. Julio Cesar? Yes, teacher. Um, it is, um, there is an umbrella on the floor. Perfect. Thank you, Julio. Number three? Anyone? Number three. Any person can participate. There is a picture on the wall. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.
Hello. I I'm sorry, guys. I'm having problems with my internet connection. So I'm going to turn off my camera, okay? But you can listen to me, right? Just imagine the teacher, the beautiful teacher's face. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, thank you, Karina, for number three. What is the number four? Cecilia? Uh, there is a uh, apple under the bed. Great, very good, Cecilia. Okay, number five. Uh, uh, there is a bike on the floor. Yes, that's correct. Number six. Can tell me on number six. There is a vase on the table. There is a vase on the table. Thank you, Anna. Number seven. There is a flower on the sofa. Ah, it's not on the sofa. It's the sofa. It's, it's the sofa. No. ¿Cuál es la? ¿A dónde está? Está. Ah, sobre. No. Encima, perdón, encima, under. Oh, it's behind, atrás de, behind. Ah, que yo estaba viendo la otra, la, la, ¿cómo se llama? Yeah, I know. La... Oh, okay, but this is a cabinet. This is a cabinet uh -huh. and this is a sofa. So there uh -huh. is a flower or plant behind the sofa, okay? Don't worry, Christopher, sí. we are learning. Okay, next, number eight. Number eight. Yes, Angie? There is a chair. Hello. There is a chair in the table. There is a chair in the table. Hi, can you hear me? Oh. Me pueden escuchar. Hello. Hi, Hello, Miss. Okay. I couldn't hear you very well, but can you hear me well? Yes, of course. Okay, thank you. I'm really sorry about the inconveniences with the internet, okay? But it's not in my mind. <laughs> In my, it's not in my hands. Uh, what about number 10? Or no, sorry, it's number nine. There is a lamb. Next to. But we have two objects, the sofa and the armchair. Between. Between, there is a lamb between the sofa and the armchair. Okay, 
What about number 10? There is a robot. On the bed. On the bed. 11, there is a mouse. There is behind mouse in the chair. <laughs> I would say there is a mouse. Uh, well, Under. Next to. Next to. Next to the chair. Mm -hmm. Okay, number 12, there is a window. There is a window behind the sofa. Okay, very good. And number 13? There is a flower. There is a flower or in, in, the, in the vase. In the vase. Remember, in the vase. In is adentro. Okay? Okay. Thank you so much. We practice the prepositions of place. Now, guys, we are going to learn about, we are going to review just no questions with the verb to be and also the negative statement. Uh, you will listen to the conversation, okay? So uh, let me play the conversation for you. You will listen to the conversation in a moment. I think it's important that you practice also listening, not only listening to me, the teacher, but also listening to other people speaking English. The conversation's topic is, are you from Rio? Where is Rio? What country is Rio in? Do you know? Brazil. It is in Brazil. Yes, in Brazil. Okay. Page 16. Exercise 2. Conversation. Are you from Rio? Can you listen to the conversation? Yes. yes. Okay, let's listen. Part A. Listen and practice. Are you from Florida, Felipe? Well, my family is in Florida now. But we're from Brazil originally. Really? My father is Brazilian, from Rio de Janeiro. So, is your first language Portuguese? No, it's English. Are you from Rio? No, we're not. We're from Sao Paulo. Okay. Very good. Um, so... They are talking about where they are from. Now you will listen to uh, the rest part of the conversation. Uh, Alexis and Felipe are talking to Fernando, Nanami, and Sofia. You will tell me if what is true and what is false, if it's true or false. Fernando is from Spain, Nanami is from Japan. Sofia's first language is French. Pay attention, please. Page 16, exercise two, part B. Listen to Alexis and Felipe talk to Fernando, Nana Mi, and Sofia. Check true or false. One. So where are you from, Fernando? I'm from Spain. Oh, what part of Spain are you from? I'm from Madrid. Two. Is your name Japanese, Nanami? Yes, it is. But I'm from the U.S., from New York. So you're American? Yes, I am. But my parents are from Japan originally. Three. By the way, Alexis, this is Sophia. Nice to meet you, Sophia. Are you from Brazil too? No, I'm from Montreal. So you're Canadian. Is your first language English? No, it's not. My first language is French. 
now you can tell me if it's true or false according to what you understand. Fernandez from Spain, true or false? Yes. True. 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 Which city is he from? He is from Madrid. Madrid. Okay, Madrid. Nanami is from Japan, true or false? False. Her name false. and her parents are from Japan, but she is American. Sophia's first language is French. True or true. false? True. 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 Very good. I'm glad that you had good listening skills. Okay. In the conversation, I like that they are using uh, questions, right? Just no questions. Are you from Florida, Felipe? The pronunciation is not Florida, it's Florida. Florida, Florida, okay? You can practice mm -hmm. Florida, Florida, okay? The emphasis is in the first syllable. And she says, well, my family is in Florida now, in Florida now, but we are from Brazil originally. Really? My father is Brazilian from Rio de Janeiro. So is your first language Portuguese? No, it's English. Are you from Rio? No, we're not. We are from Sao Paulo. So we have a negative answer here. No, we're not. Or another one. No, it's English. So when we make um, she has no questions. Remember, we use the verb to be at the beginning, then the subject, and then the complement. And we have some examples here. I would like a volunteer to read the examples. Questions. Is there a volunteer to read the example question? One person only. Okay, Karina. Are you 25 years old? Yes, I am. Is Miguel a teacher? Yes, he is. Is Erica a secretary? No, she isn't. Is Irma married? Yes, she is. Are Victoria and Ernesto co-workers? No, they aren't. Are we Guatemalan? No, we aren't. Thank you so much, Karina. So you see, we have the verb to be are, is, is, or are the subject, you, Miguel, Erika, Irma, Victoria, and Ernesto, we, and the complement, 25 years old, a teacher, a secretary, married, co-workers, Guatemala. So don't forget that for just no questions, we put the verb to be at the beginning. Now, we have the negative statement. For the negative statements, we just add not. I'm not from New York. You are not late. She's not from Russia. He's not from Italy. It's not English. We are not from Japan. You're not early. They are not in Mexico. And remember, we're is the contraction of we are. We have the questions here. I need another person to read the questions and the answers. Which one, teacher? These ones. Are you from California? Hey, Fernando, you read the questions and Julio okay. will say, the affirmative quest answer, and maybe Edward Stevens can say the negative answer. 
Is that okay, Edward Steven? And Julio? Yes. Okay. So, Fernando uh, makes the question. Julio answers affirmative. Edward answers negative. You can start now. Okay, are you ready? Are you from California? I I know you and I know from New York. Okay, and early. Sorry. Excuse me, teacher. Um, well, Julio. You, Julio says. <laughs> okay, it's que dos Julio, entonces cuando dice yeah, Julio es como. Sorry, I forgot. <laughs> Yeah, okay. but I, I, think, I think the other Julio is not connected today. I don't see him. Okay. Um, <laughs> what's the interest? Can we start again? Please, Fernando. Okay, are you ready, guys? Are you from California? Yes, I am. Edward? Edward is it? Uh, uh, yes. Negative form. Um, negative. Not, I am not. Mm -hmm. Okay, second question. Am I early? Oh. Julius? Excuse me? Repeat, please. Am I early? Mm, yes. Yes, yes you, are. you are. Yes, you are. Okay. Am I early? Steven Perez. <laughs> La estoy comprendiendo muy bien ahorita. Usted va a dar la respuesta negativa de las preguntas que está haciendo Fernando. Aquí está la respuesta. ¿eh? No, you're not. No, she's not. No, he's not. No, he's not. Etc. Ok, thank you. Next. Is she from Brazil? Yes, she is. Uh, she is not. No, she's not. No, she's not. Okay, very good. He's from Chile. Is he from Chile? No, he is not. Yes, he is. Okay. Is it Korean? Yes, it is. No, he is not. Very good. Are you from China? Yes, we are. No, we are not. Very good. Are we late? Yes, you are. No, you're not. Okay. Are they in Canada? Yes, they are. No, you're not. Okay, thank you, Julio, Edward, and Fernando. Problem, teacher. This is just a review because we have studied this before. Okay, so remember the formula structure for sentences in negative. Subject, verb to be, not, and then complement. Look at the following examples. We have more examples here. Cecilia, would you like to read the examples? Please. Que lo lea. Please, my, uh, uh, Cecilia. Okay. Number one. 
Marilyn is not from El Salvador. Number two, I am not a good driver. Number three, you're not part of my family. Number four, Carl is not my brother. Number six, it not, it's not five, pardon, it's not cloudy today. Thank you, Cecilia Veronica. So as you notice, we have the subject, the verb to be, not, and the complement, right? Mm -hmm. So I would like guys to write in the chat, type in the chat, some negative sentences, okay? In this moment, everybody type or write in the chat. Use the chat and make negative sentences. Van a ser oraciones en negativo. Vamos a empezar. Primero les voy a poner una. Si ustedes las va en affirmative and you make it negative. La voy a poner en afirmativo y usted la pone en negativo. Okay. The first one is. Ixa. Good day. Negative? The second one, the, the dinner is delicious. That is not a good day. The dinner is delicious. The dinner is not delicious. Tamales are from Honduras. <laughs> Tamales are not from Honduras. Okay. The next one, the class is early. The class isn't early. Yes. The bottle, the bottle of water is Pink. The bottle of water is pink, negative. Uh, the class isn't early. The bottle of water isn't pink. Okay. They are at home. They are at home. We are in class. They are not home, exactly. It's warm today. It's not Saturday, it's, it's Friday. The laptop is new. It's not warm today, okay. Good, so now guys, you make your own examples using negative sentences with the verb to be. Remember, we are using the verb to be. The laptop, Karina, cuando ya estamos usando the laptop, reemplazaría a it. Entonces, porque ya está el sujeto. The laptop isn't new. 
ya no es necesario usar el it. ¿Ok? Solo the laptop is, isn't new. Thank you, teacher. The verb to be. Yes, we're using the verb to be. So, uh, Julio says that you, you wrote, I don't like the heat. The sentence is correct, but you're using other verbs. And right now, we just want to use the verb to be in negative. Mm -hmm. Okay. Continue making negative statements. The house is not beautiful, okay. You, how can you make it negative? Shakira is from China? Negative? Shakira is not from China. Shakira isn't from China. Okay, make your own sentences, guys. Make your own sentences too. Brad Pitt is a good actor? Negative? What's the negative form? What is the negative form? <laughs> Brad Pittsburgh is not a good actor. <laughs> okay, Brad Pitt is a good actor. Mm -hmm. Very good. So we are making negative statements, right? Good. Okay, guys, over here you can find <laughs> Fernando is defending Brad Pitt. It's just an example, Fernando. Don't take it personal. <laughs> just kidding. We have here the numbers. We use the number to say um, the ages. Uh, for example, I am 30 years old. My mom is 60 years old. My grandmother is 87 years old. Uh, my son, I don't have a son, it's just an example. My baby is one year old or 15 months, etc. So in this in this uh, slide, you can see the different numbers and ages. I'm going to share the screen for the, the numbers and ages, okay? In a moment, you are going to listen. Just give me a moment. I'm preparing the audio. You will listen to the numbers. Page 19. Can you listen? Exercise 7. Can you listen? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Speaking. Yes. Numbers and ages. Part A. Listen and practice. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 
Forty. Fifty. Sixty. Seventy. Eighty. Eighty. Ninety. One hundred. One hundred and one. One hundred one. One hundred and two. One hundred two. One hundred and three. One. Okay. Now, um, <laughs> you can you can you could listen to the one hundred also, right? Um, you will see in this. A screen the word stress when we pronounce, for example, 13 and 30. 14 and 40. You will hear the difference when we stress or when we pronounce these numbers. Page 19, exercise 7, part B. Listen and practice. Notice the word stress. Thirteen. Thirty. Fourteen. Forty. Fifteen. Fifty. Sixteen. Sixty. Do you see the difference? In the pronunciation, if you notice with these numbers, the last syllable teen it has the the stress, and with the others numbers, the stress yes. the best in the first syllable: thirty, in the forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eight, and nine. So right now. I'm going to ask you a question. The question is, how old are you? How old are you? Everybody will tell me your age. Okay, that's gonna be the question today. How old are you? And to answer, we say, I am in the number. Um, in my case, I am 30. I am 30 years old. So I'm going to be one by one asking your age. Okay? So let's see. Claudia, how old are you? How old are you, Claudia? I am, I am one. I am twenty-one. one. Yes, don't forget to use the verb to be. I am. Uh, I am twenty-one. Um, uh, are you? Claudia, how, uh -huh. Claudia, how old are you? Are you Mr. very good? No, 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 how old are you, Claudia? I am, I am, I am 21 years old. Very good, Claudia. Thank you. Emmanuel, how old are you? I am 25 years old. Wow. Okay. Thank you. Wow. Christopher, how old are you? Uh, how old are you? 19 year old. I am. I am ah. 
19. I am 19 year old. Yes, because if in the first answer, así como <laughs> cuando respondí el primero, escuché como yo tengo 90. <laughs> ah, no, no, no. Ajá. Soy el más joven. Uy, dije yo, 90. <laughs> That's why you have to make the emphasis in the teen. Okay, I am 19 years old. Very good, Christopher. Okay, another person. Emily Ramos, how old are you? I am 21 years old. Oh, you're 21 too, okay. Jacqueline Guzman, how old are you? I am 24 years old. Okay, 24. Ana Maricela Vázquez, how old are you? I am 32. Oh, okay, you are older than me. You are 32. <laughs> okay, let's see. Edward Steven, how old are you? I am 21 years old. 21, okay, you're really young too. Okay, let's see. Uh, Ana Silvia Joachim, how old are you? I am 26 years old. 26 years old, okay. Julio, oh. Yes, Julio Echeverria. Uh, I am 26 years old. 26. Okay, Karina, how old are you? I am 31 years old. Really? I am 30 and you're 31. <laughs> we are almost the same age. Veronica Hernandez, Cecilia? I am 46 years old. 46, okay. Thank you, Cecilia. <laughs> you could be um, Christopher's mother, <laughs> right? <laughs> or yes, I was mom. Or Emily's mother. <laughs> Fernando, how old are you? I'm 27 years old. You're 27, okay. Denise? I am 28 years old. 28, you don't look like 28. Carla Navarro? I am 32 years old. 32, like Karina. Uh, Jennifer? I am 33. 33, okay. Francisco? Yes. Javier, how old are you? I am 19 or 19. 19 years old. Okay, you? Carla Lucia. 19, sí. For who are you? Carla Lucia, how old are you? Okay, I think she's busy. Well, guys, it's important to practice, right? How old are you? How old are you? Okay. Now in this conversation, you will see how we can uh, talk about our family. And we can see some questions and expressions. Who's that? She's my sister. She's really pretty. What's her name? Madison, we call her Maddie. Madison, that's a beautiful name. How old is she? She's 28. And what's she like? Is she nice? Well, she's shy, but she's really kind. And who's that little girl? That's her daughter, Mia. She is six years old. She's cute. Yes, yeah, she is. And she's very smart too. So the conversation is, who's that? Quien es? We usually uh, show pictures, right? Or we post 
or upload pictures on our social media, WhatsApp, say, status, or maybe Facebook or Instagram. And maybe we can ask other people about the people in the pictures. Like in this case, you can ask, who is that? Quien es, right? She's my sister. She's really pretty. What's her name? We can ask about the name. We can ask, as you can see here, okay, what's her name? How old is she? What's she like? What's she like? Is she nice? Como es ella? What's she like? Is she nice? Who is that little girl? Okay. So repeat after me. Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? What's her name? Who's that little girl? What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? How old is she? How old is she? What's she like? What's she like? What's she like? Who is that little girl? Who's that little girl? Who's that little girl? Who's that little girl? Exactly. Okay. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna be staying here. The boys are happy. The boys are happy. Okay, look at this picture. And this picture, you can ask me questions about this picture. Can you ask me questions <laughs> about the pictures? Where were you from? No, about the pictures that you can see in this presentation. The little girl? Who is that little girl? Who is that little girl? Who is that Who little girl? Yeah, uh, die. Who is that little girl? She is my niece. Who's that guy? How old is she? She is eight years old. What's her name? Uh, her name is Sophia. What does she like? What she like? <laughs> What she like? What she like? Uh, she friendly and sweet. More questions. Who is that? Who's that man? He's my brother. He's my oldest brother. How old is he? He's forty years old. What his name? His name is Walter. What's your name? <clears throat> Hi, the other question? Where is he from? What is your profession? My profession is teacher. What is his he, profession? His profession is supervisor. He's a bank supervisor. Mm -hmm. Do you like nature? He loves nature. He loves biking and going to the mountains, going to the beach, etc. Okay, so let's review the questions. Remember, what is the first the first question? Who's who's that? Or who's that man? Who's that girl? Or who's that man? Who's that? What? Uh huh. What? 
he or her is name. Her name. Mm -hmm. How old is how old is she? Or how old is she? Or is she is mm -hmm. what's he like, like? or what he like? She like. Ah, esta pregunta no significa que le gusta a él, no, significa cómo es. La palabra like también significa cómo. ¿Cómo es él o cómo es ella? ¿Eh? But if, if I want to ask que le gusta. Ah, ahí sí es what does he like or what does she like. Pero tiene que ser más específico. Por ejemplo, what food yes. does he, he like? She's like? What color does he like? Um, what music, what kind of music does she like? But in this case, is what he like? Significa como es. Como es ella en su personalidad, personality. And the possible answers or examples, for example, could be. Who is that? You can say she's my niece. She's my niece. Ah, oh, she's my niece. Yes, my sobrina. She's my niece. Who is that girl? Right, she's my she? niece. Who is that man? He's my brother. He's my brother. What's his name? His name is Walter. His name is Walter. Mm -hmm. How old is he? He's or, or is oh, 40 years uh, old. 14 year old. No, 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 es 14. 40. Sí, 40. 40. 40. Ajá, 14. 14. Ajá. What's he like? ¿Cómo es él? He's very funny. Very fun and responsible. Ella es responsable. Él, él, he. Muy, ella es muy responsable. He significa él, Claudia. He is very funny and responsible. I'm sorry. Hmm? Yeah, don't worry. Very okay, good. Very so fun. look at the, this is the example, guys. And this is going to be your homework. Esto lo van a estar okay. tarea. Lo pueden hacer en un, doc, en un documento de Word o en, no sé, en su teléfono. Van a poner una foto o dos, dos fotos o una foto familia, una foto ahí de, de dos personas juntas. Y van a poner las preguntas. Who is that? Who is that girl? Who is that woman? What's his name? Lo van a hacer con dos personas. Dos personas que estén en la foto. ¿Sí? Como el ejemplo. ¿Sí? Van a tener el fin de semana para poder hacer. para que you don't forget it. So this is gonna be your homework. Okay guys, before we go, because we only have some minutes, I need you to call, I need you to make these sentences in negative. Van a poner estas oraciones en negativo. And meanwhile, I am no a teacher. Exactly. She is not my mother. Very nice. She. Ah. Okay, but in this case, <laughs> we my, the sentence. Uh -huh. I know. 
mother. She's not my mother. Exactly. My mother. Mm -hmm. Now we have here a question. The boy happy her. Are the boys happy? Are, are the boys? Are the boys? Are the boys? The girl is the room. The girl is in the room. Number five. We are. We are not at home. home. Mm -hmm. Number five. Uh, next one. My dad. My dad, dad is smart. My dad is smart. My mother. Smart. Mother is housewife. Yes. Okay. Hey? She, she's not my sister. She's not my sister. Ah, and the next is an important question. Is the teacher angry? Yes, she is very angry when she is hungry. <laughs> when she's hungry, she's very angry. <laughs> okay, the next dog in the kennel. The dog is in the kennel. Yeah, another exercise, but where eh? is I here? We have to complete. Eh, the we have to complete the conversations. Help me, please. Are, Are Diana and Mari from, from Ecuador. Ecuador? No. No. No, are, are not. No, are not. Mm. No, they are not. No, they are not. No, they are not. Did they? No, they are they not. Are not. <clears throat> they are from Mexico. Mexico. Okay. Okay. Next. Are. Are you from Mexico? Are not. No, I am not. No, I am. I, I am. No. I'm from Colombia. Uh -huh. So, mm. so yeah. is your first language mm -hmm. Spanish? Yes, it is not. Yes, it is. Okay, conversation two. Mira is a woman. It is. Is Mira from Australia? Mm. Is from England? <laughs> no, she no, she's no, not. She is not. No, she's, she's not uh, she's from, from Australia. Is, is she from Sydney? Uh, is. is from Sydney? Is, is not. She yes, she is. Yes, she is. Yes, she is. She is. But her parents are from India. I'm not from. I'm not. From Está hablando de los yes. 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 Hindi? No, no there is no. In. Are. Mm -mm. Is, are. Mm -mm. No. Está hablando del idioma. First language. No. First language. It's not. No. It's not. It's English. It's not. It's, it's English. 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 Okay. Is not Number three. It's yeah. um, it Joe. Are, 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 are you? Are you in, in Guangzhou? Are you from South Korea? We are. We are. Yes, we are. We are. And yes, we are. Um, are, are, are you from Seoul? No. It, I am. No, we are. No, we are not. not. From the from, yeah. Yeah, from, we are from. We are. We are from. 
What did you learn today? One example, please. For example, today I learned about uh, numbers. One example, uh, or date. Hey, how old are you? One example is, how old are you? I am 27 years old. One activity I like. What? Y en lo, que escriben, en lo que escriben en el chat, les voy Excuse a decir. Excuse me, teacher. La asistencia. Yes. Se atenda. Yes. So please don't go. Don't go. I want you to stay. Please don't go. Don't go. And remember, guys, you need to complete the platform porque el lunes se lo van a realizar a primera hora. Así que tienen que meterse en fin de semana para ponerse al día. Aleida Marilín Gómez, absent. Alvin de Jesús Cuchilla, ausente, absent. Ana Maricela Vázquez, present. Ana Silvia. Present. Angie Romero. Present. Cecilia Verónica. Present. Christopher Goche. Present. Claudia Clima. Present, teacher. Daniel Arisa. Daniel Arisa. No está. Yo recuerdo haberla visto. Ok. Mm, ¿Denis? Present. Ok. Edward Steven Pérez. Present. Uh -huh. Ok. Juan. Emily Azucena. Present. Eh, Emanuel Eliseo. En Manuel Eliseo. Present. I'm here. Okay, Fernando Enrique. I'm here. Francisco Javier. Present. Gabriela María. When is your birthday? Karina Baño. Present. Hacer Beatriz, Je Jacqueline Janet, present, Jennifer Ivonne, here, Jorge Beltrán, Jorge Martínez, Jorge Beltrán. No sé. Will. Jorge Ernesto. Sí. José Adalberto López. Jocelyn Esmeralda. Jocelyn Esmeralda. Julio sí, César no. Reyes. Si sí, tengo que meter las tablas. Here, teacher, present. Julio Echeverría. Present, teacher. Eh, Carla Navarro. Present, teacher. Carla Lucía. Ahí está Jorge Beltrán. Jorge Arquímedes. <laughs> but you need to say present. 
Okay, guys, thank you so much for your attendance to the class this evening. I'm sorry that because of my connection, internet connection, I had my camera off, but I hope that on Monday we don't have more problems, okay? Uh, please work on the platform this weekend, do the homework, and see you next Monday. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. See you on Monday. Who is alone? Have a nice weekend. Hi, teacher. Who is alone? Enjoy your weekend. You too. Good night, teacher. Good night. Thank you, Karina, for your participation in the chat. Bye. Take care of <laughs> Bye. you. Bye. Bye, teacher.